Now she's just told me as a judge to look at the bum. All right, it's a bit like it. It's a bit like if I stood here and went like this. You'd all look up and look at what I was looking at. All right. If you've got a fault on your dog, ignore it. If you ignore it, the judge will ignore it. Okay. What we tend to do is keep, you know, say your dog's got a high tail, and in your breed you shouldn't have a high tail. All right. You keep watching it. Put the tail down every now and then, walk it down like this, you know. Uh, judge notices those things and they're going to be thinking, oh, but that's got a high tail when I come to go over it. All right, don't give them any excuse. So, imagine Hazel already, well she has, Hazel has a beautiful front, even though her back end wasn't any good and this is what the handler was worried about. If this handler started focusing on what a good front the dog had, we're going to draw the judge's arm. All right, so if it was me, especially if the dog in front of me has got a really poor front, all right, mean as I am, I might keep admiring it. I might just go and take Isn't that nice? Look at that person. Just a perfect. All right, and the judge starts going, oh, actually, yeah, that's quite good. And you're going, yeah, that one has not All right, so really, really important. Now, when we're running, exactly as I said before, there's running and there's running, all right? Katie, I want you to go for a jog with your dog around the ring. This is what most people do. I'm just going to jog. So, now we're going to have to jog. She makes it. Thank you. 